More than half a dozen already ban it, and now you can soon add Cleveland State to the list of Ohio public colleges and universities that don't allow the use of tobacco on campus. University trustees just approved the policy. News Channel 5's Paul Kiska is live at CSU tonight. And Paul, this could affect people who aren't students or employees of CSU as well. Well, that's right, Lee, but because this campus is right smack dab in the middle of downtown Cleveland, enforcing it could be a little bit tricky. But the bottom line here is to make this campus healthier. Banning smoking inside caused a side effect. More people smoking outside, which didn't prevent the smoke from ending up inside. One of the complaints that we've had is, is people passing through secondhand smoke. And the smoke actually infiltrates all the way into the buildings up to the third and fourth floor. 17,000 students at CSU. It's estimated more than 4,000 smoke. We don't want to tell people what not to do, but what we really want to do here is promote a healthy lifestyle. Enforcing the smoking ban campus-wide could be tricky in a public setting where streets and sidewalks run through the middle of campus. What we're looking to do now is to find what the perimeters of the campus are for the smoking policy and look at other best practices from other, other universities and the Cleveland Clinic, places like that, and see how they do it best. Students believe the no smoking message will focus on students and staff, hard to enforce on people walking by. Either way, the smoking ban starts next fall. Well, seeing as how it's real close to the clinic and the clinic's a non-smoking campus and that health line and everything, I mean, it makes sense, but um, I just think it's going to be hard to monitor. The campus is downtown and trying to ban like a section of downtown for smoking is going to make it like, I think it's just going to be tricky. Outdoor designated smoking huts will be considered. I think if they put a small smoking area in maybe more than one place, I mean, it's a pretty big campus, that people would be able to use that and respect the new rules. It would just take some adjustment. And programs that help people quit smoking will be offered to faculty, students, and staff here at Cleveland State University. Live downtown, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5.